welcome once again to another edition of the Red Brennan Williams Real Estate Show. I'm Shannon Deskins along with Jennifer Brown Day and I guess we could say Happy Thanksgiving because we just had a great Thanksgiving. We did. Hopefully everybody had a very blessed Thanksgiving and is ready for the rest of the holiday season. Yeah, we are officially in the holiday craziness that leads up to Christmas and New Year's. But you guys in, in your business, that can be a, a busy time for you all. It can. Surprisingly, there's a lot going on in those time frames. And my real estate minute, I'm actually going over why it's a great time to keep your house listed or to go mm -hmm. ahead and list your house during the holidays. And I guess a lot of that is, you know, kids are home from school. You've got that time as a family that you can kind of make family decisions and Plus, well, no question, we're coming out of Thanksgiving and into Christmas. These houses may feel a little bit tight right now. <laughs> exactly. You've got kids off school for different mm -hmm. holidays. You've got the toys piling up after Christmas. So, yeah, looking for an upgrade might be around the first of the year. All right. And we've got some interesting options for you today. Uh, as far as part of the show and a lot of the show today is about an auction or some auctions that are going to happen. We've got a couple reserve auctions and some absolutes to talk about. The first one that we're going to mention uh, is actually in Paintsville. It is. This one is on Court Street in Paintsville at 712 Court Street. All of these auctions do have signs posted. So if okay. you want to do drive-bys, feel free on any of the auctions we talk about. And that location in Court Street is right downtown Paintsville. And this one is going to be December the 8th at 11 o'clock. So you can, on this one, schedule a showing ahead of time if you uh -huh. want by calling the Paintsville office. Or you can show up an hour before that morning and kind of do a walkthrough, correct? Absolutely. The properties will be completely open an hour before that morning. So at 10 a.m., somebody will be there to allow you to walk through. Or if that time frame doesn't work for you, our Paintsville office can set up showings for any time that's convenient. Right. Now, this one does have a reserve. So there is a, a, a price point that needs to be met. Um, but above that... What is it, 10% that they need to have the day of the auction? That's correct. The typical terms for an auction are 10% mm -hmm. down the day of the auction, and then the rest is going to be paid within a typical closing time. So 45 to 60 days is what you're looking for for the rest of it. Three bedrooms, two bathrooms, uh, just over 1,700 square feet. That's correct. And then this one also has the outdoor space. You've got a private rear patio. You have a detached garage. Mm -hmm. You're walking distance to all the schools downtown, shopping, restaurants, anything downtown is right there and convenient. And we talk about a lot how downtown Paintsville is changing and growing um, and becoming more attractive. Uh, but 712 Court Street is this one. Again, that auction is going to be December the 8th at 11 o'clock. So if you have any questions on that, Call the Paintsville office, correct? Absolutely. Call the Paintsville office, the number 606-789-8119. And both of the auctions in Paintsville actually do have MLS numbers. They're actually okay. listed properties. So you can actually look them up on the website as well. All right. Now the next one, now this could be a little bit confusing. It's another reserve auction, but it's the same day, mm -hmm. December the 8th. But this one is later in the afternoon. So if you miss your opportunity on the first one, you can come back. Uh, the next one is at 2 o'clock. Correct. And the same thing applies. It will be open an hour before. So starting mm -hmm. at 1 p.m. on that same day, the property will be open for you to look at. Or you can schedule an appointment beforehand to go through the property. This one is four bedrooms, two bathrooms. Now this one is pushing 4,000 square feet. So this is a really spacious home. And you can tell uh, from some of the pictures, you, know, you can tell you've got a big kitchen. You've got a big living room. And all of it looks to be open. Yes, it is. It's a fairly open layout. It's that old southern plantation home mm -hmm. style and layout with the big front porch and all that. Um, the great thing about this one is you are still in the downtown area. You're right there on Richmond, um, in the Richmond Village area out towards the golf course, but it comes with a half acre lot. So you're getting something in, in a progressive downtown area or close to downtown Paintsville, but you're, it's like you're stepping back in time with the house that you could potentially get. Absolutely. This is one that will definitely take you back in time, but it's got a lot of, um, you know, amenities that somebody's really going to like. It actually comes with a second kitchen in the main house. It's got wow. a first floor bedroom. And then this one actually has a smaller second home on the property that would be great for rental potential or mm -hmm. something like that. And it's always positive when you can talk to, about a home and then say this could also help you make your mortgage payment. Um, when you've got that second or that possible rental opportunity. And this one does come with that. This one, again, is a reserve auction. Um, so 
it's hard to tell what it could go for. There is a minimum that you have to meet, but above right. that, I mean, who knows? These, these are interesting. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's up to the people who, who want that piece of property. Again, this is December the 8th. Mm -hmm. This one is at 2 o'clock. Um, and again, if you have any questions on either one of those two, uh, contact the Paintsville office. Let's give that office number one more time. Okay, that number is 606-789-8119. Okay, now we'll switch gears a little bit. We're still going to talk about an auction that's coming up. Uh, but this one is an absolute auction, mm -hmm. so there's no minimum. This could be anything. And there are seven properties with this auction. And let's talk about how that's going to work. How that's going to work, an absolute auction, like you said, there is no minimum. Everything will be sold at the auction one way or the other. There are seven different properties, but they're all together. So it will be auctioned separately as seven different parcels. And then after that, we will actually auction it all as one. Whichever way it brings the most money is how it will actually sell. Now these are in the Virgie area of Pike County. Mm -hmm. All of them are kind of together. I'm assuming they're with a, a family, um, a, a family unit, right? At some point, right. This is, they're all right there on Long Fork. I'm going to give you one of the addresses and then all of them are kind of right there together. And again, you can drive by and mm -hmm. I think you'll be able to tell pretty easily what all is being sold. But if you go to 1784 Long Fork Road, that's kind of where everything starts and then everything is around in that area. So all of these are potential if, if you're somebody that's wanting to either expand your rental properties or get into this would be a great starter way to get into exactly. to rental properties. Yeah, exactly. Pretty much all of them have uh, buildings on them. Uh, most of them are houses. You have one old church. You have one that is going to be sold as a one acre lot only. It mm -hmm. has a mobile home on it now, but that will not be sold with the property. And then you have one that's an older home that it would take a real some creativity Magician to yes. get it back in in good order so you can either look at it as a lot or a, a major fixer upper the only difference with these this is completely sold as is so right. as you see it as it sits that day that is how it's being sold okay now this one again what's the date on this auction this one is December 15th Okay. Auction starts at 11 a.m. and again viewing will start at 10 a.m. that day. This one is really interesting to me because you've got so many different things and it's going to be sold. Mm -hmm. So there's no reserve that has to be met. It's, you know, according to who comes and what they want to bid. So those are always really interesting to me. But is the Pikeville office um, someplace they can call for this one? Absolutely. Call the Pikeville office, the number 606-437-2333. Okay. Now, the last two pieces of property we're going to talk about, these are actual listings. We're out of the mm -hmm. auction now, and we'll talk about a couple homes. The first one is at Feds Creek. It is. So we're staying in Pike County. This mm -hmm. is going to be a ranch home that's around 1,800 square feet, and it sits right there on the main Feds Creek Road. And I like this one because, you know, a lot of times you talk about ranch homes, and they're popular for people that don't want to do steps or can't do steps. So this one's all on one level. It is. It's all on one level. It is a brick ranch, so you don't have to worry mm -hmm. about all that maintenance or anything like that. Um, it's a three bedroom, one bath, and then it sits on a really nice lot. You've got about a half acre lot with it. And this one is one that if you want to come in and you fix it up and, and put your own touch to it, it's priced to where you can do that. When you're looking at the square footage, like you said, almost 1,900 square feet, this mm -hmm. one's listed for just over 100 thousand and one oh nine nine so under a hundred ten thousand buy this one and use your extra budget to fix it how you want it exactly and the agent even uh, specifically puts on there that there's additional space on the sides and the rear of the house mm -hmm. so if it would be something that you need more space you want to add a bathroom or you want to add an extra bedroom it sounds like that you have the space to do that as well and this was, a, you know, a good opportunity for somebody that wants to spend the money, be a homeowner and come in and own it, but yet you want to do some of the work yourself or you want to be, make it your own because you're on a half acre. So mm -hmm. you've got, like you said, plenty of space to expand. Exactly. You've got that space. And then you also have a one car garage with the house that, you know, can be great storage, can mm -hmm. be used as a garage, or you can finish it out and actually have it be part of the house as well. So I think this one is one that's going to be attractive uh, to, to the person who wants to put their own, buy mm -hmm. the house, they don't want to actually go through all the steps and take a couple of years to build one, right. but yet you want to buy something 
and then make it your own. This right. would be perfect for that. The price, one oh nine nine on this one. It's right off Main Feds Creek Road, so mm -hmm. accessibility is not going to be a problem. So this one's Tom Deskin's listing. Let's talk about how to get a hold of him. Okay, you can call Tom in either office, Pikeville mm -hmm. or Paintsville. The Pikeville number, 606-437-2333. Okay, now we'll end the show with another one of Tom's listings, but we'll jump back into Johnson County. This one is in Paintsville. This one is in Paintsville, and this is a really interesting property. It's right there on Broadway, which if you're familiar at all with Paintsville, is kind of the main drag mm -hmm. um, as you exit town, but it's right there on the main drag. Um, it's a lot of commercial space, so this is being... Um, marketed as a commercial building but of course you can tell in the pictures it's a very cute older home. I know and I'm thinking of all the different commercial opportunities that mm -hmm. whether it's retail and you want a cute you know retail with the storefront and all that or you want to do an office space uh, this would fit both of those uh, and it looks like there's a, a lot of space uh, to be able to work with. Exactly. There's almost 1,200 square feet. You've got three bedrooms and a bathroom. Of course, that's with mm -hmm. the old layout. You could easily make that three offices. You um, have a living area that would be great for, you know, a boardroom or mm -hmm. retail space, a showroom, depending on what your need is. But the main thing is you're right there on Broadway, so whatever the commercial need is, you would have a great visibility. Right. This one is one where location speaks for mm -hmm. itself on this one because we've talked about how Paintsville is growing um, and how a lot of people come in there to do business and mm -hmm. this was like you said on the main road that goes through Paintsville uh, and this one is one that, that these opportunities don't come up very often. They don't. Especially not to purchase. in this area. Exactly. Not to purchase and it has a lot of those um, older home amenity so the mm -hmm. original hardwood flooring the so if you're doing it for a showroom or retail space you can really play up on that char charming older home and make it really work for you right and not very often that you can see commercial properties that can go either way mm -hmm. sometimes we've done some in the past recently that were like this was a former dentist office or doctor's office so it's set up with exam rooms this one is set up to where you could really take whatever your retail business mm -hmm. is and make it fit this piece of property. And the outside of it is just, it almost looks, we're coming into Christmas, so I've got gingerbread home. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I can see the Christmas lights. So there's a ton of possibilities uh, with this one. And like we said, a great location. Yes, a great location. This one you can call the Paintsville office for more information on. That number is 606-789-8119. And this one is also Tom's listing. All right, so ask for Tom and he'll take care of you. Mm -hmm. So we, we've kind of gone across the board today as far <laughs> as we've had auctions, some reserve, some absolute and then some listings but every bit of this someone can find on your website absolutely you can go to rbnw.com for more information on anything all right and we as we mentioned at the beginning of the show in the real estate minute you're going to talk about the holidays and why it's a good opportunity or a good time for you to list your property absolutely Are the holidays a good time to list your home or to keep your home listed? Absolutely. There are many benefits to your home being on the market during the holiday season, including less competition. Your house will raise to the top of the competition because it is not typically a heavy listing time. Decor. During the holidays, your home looks and smells amazing. Don't go overboard, but use the holiday decorations to your advantage. Serious buyers. If a potential buyer is out looking during the holidays and the colder weather, most probably they are seriously looking for a new home. Possibly a faster closing time. Typically the holidays tend to be a slower selling time, so take advantage. Overburdened lenders might be able to speed up your closing. All these points are great reasons to keep your house listed or to list your home during the holiday season. The Realtors of Ray Brown and Williams will be honored to assist you with listing your home for the holidays. Thank you for watching the Ray Brown and Williams Real Estate Show. See you again soon.